It's hard to believe this day has finally come on multiple levels. First off, that we have completed the first major stage of our lives, and second off, that we as a class are able to celebrate this achievement in light of the pandemic. Reflecting on my time at Providence, there have been many challenges that come with such a small school. I have struggled with the small class sizes, limited sporting opportunities, and the less ability to make a lot of friends. However, during such reflection, I have also come to realize how deep the relationships I've built have been, something I'm extremely grateful for, as well as the benefits of a school like this. Some of those benefits include the personalized attention and care that the teachers give, the fact that they want you to succeed and learn, and the emphasis being not only on education, but also on becoming the best person you can be. We are also given many opportunities that those at other schools might not receive, such as the Europe trip and the upper school, but, uh, upper school retreats. I will always cherish those memories, as well as my memories on the basketball court. I would also like to thank a few people who have helped me along the way throughout high school. First off, I'd like to thank my parents for always encouraging me to do the best I can in everything that I took on, for supporting me during my highs and my lows. I'd also like to thank my teachers for expending so much effort to give me and my classmates such a quality education and world view. In particular, I would like to thank Mr. Buckles for his patience, especially during our class's younger years, Mr. Keating for his individual focus on us as more than just students, but as people, Ms. Brewer for helping our class with so much more than just writing, and Mr. Matul for his wisdom and humor. Finally, I would like to thank my coaches throughout the years. First off, Coach McCarthy for coaching us through a rebuilding year, teaching us both the fundamentals of basketball and also how to be better men. Next, Coach Marcotte for never giving up on us and giving us the locker room motivation in key moments. Finally, Coach Keaton for sacrificing so much to be able to coach us and giving me the best post defense he's got. <laughs> Although I do not have time to thank everyone individually who has impacted me along the way, I know that you are appreciated. I'd like to end this by exhorting you all to recognize that we only have one chance to live our lives, and we might live meaningful, impactful lives to an awful degree.